Hi everybody, George Steele 88 with another video. Title of this video, Deshaun Elliott signed, Van Jefferson signed, and Kenny Pickett traded to the Eagles. So let's get into it. So Steelers made roster moves yesterday and more importantly today. I'm going to start with the one they made yesterday. Yesterday, they signed safety Deshaun Elliott. Now, Deshaun Elliott, he was he was a six-round pick by the Baltimore Ravens in 2018. And he played with Patrick Queen for about at least two seasons with Patrick Queen who's now playing for the Steelers. And Deshaun Elliott, he is not a one-dimensional safety. This guy could do it all. Almost like Troy Palmolo, but he don't make these crazy plays like Troy Palmolo does. But Deshaun Elliott, man, he, he can wreck the game too. He got hustle ability too. He can play the ball and he, he can go out and hit people. Just like I see with Derrick, just like he, he did what did to um, Derrick Henry. That was when we were with Baltimore. And then he played one season with Detroit in 2022 and played a season with the Dolphins. And I can say about Deshaun Elliott, he is not a one-dimensional safety. This guy is like almost a playmaker. He could he could play the he could play the ball and hit people and get them in the box when need to. So that will keep Mika Fitzpatrick for doing that. Because Mika, Mika Fitzpatrick. He's a ball hawking safety. Cause that's why um that's why he that's why he didn't, he didn't get a lot of interceptions last season. Or none at all. So and Deshaun Elliott, he's uh 26 years old or well he'd be 27 in 27 next month. So so I mean we got ourselves a pretty good safety in Deshaun Elliott. So, so yeah, man. So Deshaun Elliott, welcome to the um, Steelers. And then, um, cause he gonna be a strong safety in my opinion. And Keon, cause Demar Casey, he, he he's not a pretty good safety. Although he he's an average safety at best. And Keon O'Neal didn't work out pretty well, and he failed the physical. So, yeah. So so Deshaun Elliott, welcome to um Steelers Nation, man. And then we just signed today. We just signed wide receiver Van Jefferson to a one-year contract. So we signed Van Jefferson from the Atlanta Falcons. Now Van Jefferson, he was a um, second-round pick of the Los Angeles Rams in 2020 draft, and he won one Super Bowl with the um, Rams. He's been about he's been about um, four and a half seasons with the um, Rams, but in, in, during the 2023 season, he was traded to the Atlanta Falcons and played with Arthur Smith, and now he's back with Arthur Smith with us. I mean, he's not going to be a starting wide receiver, but he's going to be our death piece to the um, to our receiving core. Because so I'm hoping we sign Tyler Boyd. That's what I'm hoping. So we got, I mean, Van Jefferson can be a pretty good receiver, though. I don't know if he can play a slot or outside, but I saw part of his highlight tape, but he can be pretty good. He got some speed. I mean, so yeah, man. So we got Van Jefferson. So Van Jefferson, welcome to Steeler Nation, man. And wow, I did not see this coming. And Steeler Nation, we had traded Kenny Pickett to the Philadelphia Eagles. For it for um for two seven, seven, for two set to a um, third round pick of this year's draft to to um and we get two twenty twenty five seven round picks. Kenny Pickett, man. Oh I did not see this shit coming, man. Kenny Pickett, man, I I heard um Found some posts on social media that said that he did not want to be in Pittsburgh, and I don't blame him. I just said, "Hey, man, you can get your bitch ass out of Pittsburgh because you don't." Ever since we signed um, 
Russell Wilson, and that frustrated Kenny Pickett. Hey, you don't want to be a Packer, Russell Wilson? Well, like I said, man, get your bitch ass out. So, yeah, so, because yeah, we're not put up with this diva shit right anymore for the Steelers organization. We see enough divas for for a while. Because when, because Kevin Corbett, I mean, Omar Khan, man, he don't, he ain't about that bullshit. He said, if you're not, not playing up to his standards, I will fire your ass right on the right on spot. Or I can, I can cut your ass right on the spot. Because Omar Khan ain't, ain't playing no games, man. I, like I've been saying, because Omar Khan don't play no games. This is like my time was said. We need volunteers, not hostages. And Kenny Pickett turned out to be a hostage after we signed Russell Wilson. And I brought his jersey, and it's a shame to have to retire it. Because because um, going to 2022, I thought he was going to take a step back to being a, um, a Pro Bowl quarterback or a pro quarterback. But that failed because he kept missing wide receivers. We see wide receivers open, and he doesn't look for him. He doesn't throw to him. And ever since he got hurt, they made him want to play third string, but he said he didn't want to play with the third string. And I made a video after we lost to the Browns about this loss on Katie Pickett. And then, man, I made that video on that. And I raged on that. I raged. Y'all can say Matt Canada um, screw Katie Pickett. That, be, that could be that, but that's not only the problem. Kenny Pickett's problem is Kenny Pickett's problem. So, hey, I didn't see this shit coming, but Omar Khan's cleaning up the mess that Kevin Colbert made. So, sorry Kenny Pickett didn't want to be here, so hey, you don't want to be in Pittsburgh? Hey, hey get, your, get your bitch ass out. So, hey, is what it is. So. So yeah, man. So Kenny Pick is traded to the Eagles. And we get a, another third round pick. And two 2025 seven round picks. I'm telling you, man. Because Omar Khan is not a lazy GM like Kevin Corbett is. I may talk more about that in another video. In, in like a near future or something like that. But I don't know. So. But Kevin Colbert is not done. Because Kevin Colbert is going to keep striking, though. Know? I know the Van Jefferson trade is not flashy. I mean, Jeff Jefferson's sign is not flashy. But, hey, it's what it is. So, Kenny Pickett, get your bitch ass out of Pittsburgh. We don't need you. You want to pound complain? You, know, you want to be a star? Don't want to uh, learn under Roy Wilson? Hey, then get the hell out of Pittsburgh then. Because Omar Khan does not like Divas at all, and I don't like him either. So, so yeah, man. So Omar Khan is not done cleaning up this mess, though. Because I got a feeling we're going to have one hell of a draft. So, yeah. So Deshaun Elliott is signed. Van Jefferson signed. Can you pick a trade to the um, Eagles? So... So, yeah, man. So, let me know what you think down in the comment section down below about this trade, about what what went down yesterday and today with the um, Deshaun Elliott signing and Van Jefferson signing and then Kenny Pickett and Trey because I'm everybody Kenny Pickett and Trey. Some of them are. So, yeah. So, that about do it for this video. This is Jordan Steel 88. See you guys in my next video. And as always, here we go, Steelers. Here we go. Yeah, man.